This one's pretty epic. I got to show it to you guys. This one was shared by uh, Mr. Guns and Gear. <laughs> this is pretty epic. Wait until you see this. You kind of have to laugh about this. But before we get into that, make sure you hit that like. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below. I appreciate all you guys to support me here in the Jarhead 6 channel. <laughs> All right, so this dude is stealing what the news is calling an AK, but it's not an AK, it's an AR-15. Uh, obviously, you, you guys can tell that right away. But again, uh, I just want to show you this real quick because it's, it's pretty crazy. So big shout out to Mr. Guns and Gear. He actually shared this. He said, that is a very strange AK, right? And let's come back over here. And uh, actually, let's start it from the beginning. I want you guys to see it. And full screen, right? And this guy essentially take this AR and watch what he does. Video showing a man trying to steal an AK He's trying to steal an AK-47, people. So <laughs> that is not an AK-47, but I know it's kind of funny. But this is just to show what the media reports, right? Somebody out there that have no information regarding guns or anything like that would actually think that that's an AK-47. So again, just to show you how the media constantly gets to run and uh, it is what it is, right? So video showing a man trying to steal an AK-47 by shoving it down his pants. An employee of a gun and pawn shop stopped the man after wow. he limped out the door with the Wow, that is just crazy. This dude is putting an AR in his pants. I mean, that, wow. That's just wow. I mean, I don't, he's, he has to have some kind of mental issue or something like that. Cause you know, you're going to get cut. You know, you're not going to walk out of the, out of the store with this gun and, 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 and just like whatever. Right. So it's just not going to happen. So again, crazy guy here trying to take a gun. Fortunately, you know, you have security cameras and things like that. No wonder why some of the salesmen are armed because, you know, stupid people doing stupid stuff. Uh, you see it right there. But again, I just wanted to point out how the media got to run and they always get to run. But again, once somebody listens to this information, the damage is already being made, right? If they come back later tonight and they say, you know what? Uh, it was not a, an AK. It was an AR. The damage already been run. People think the wrong thing all the time. And obviously, you see cases like this and you see it all over the place. Everybody remember that guy in California that, that made a stupid statement. This is a clip and he could shoot like a bazillion rounds in a second. People listen to that stuff and people get like, wow. So it's our job. I say this all the time to educate people. Not in a way where like, hey, man, it's your second amendment. You should do whatever you want in a way where you could just be like, hey, you know what? Here's why we have this gun. Here's why we do this. Here's why we do that, right? So, again, just something to put out there. Educate the communities on firearms. And you know what? When we do that, we actually bring people to our side. Let me know what you think. Put comments down below. And as always, God is in control.